Hi storytellers, my name is Director Thorne and welcome back to Abzu. Now you might notice that this doesn't have a webcam. I tried to fix that, but it's a little broken, so hopefully next time I'll have a face cam for it. But for this episode, it's just gonna be my voice and the gameplay. So hopefully that doesn't bug you guys too much. Uh, and hopefully it's just for one episode and I can get it fixed for the next half. Uh, <laughs> this is kind of strange because most of my interaction is body. Ooh, meditation. Push the right button. Nope, that's somersault. There we go. Figuring out the right button. Okay, back button to meditate. What is the back button? Nope, not that. That's not what I wanted. Unless that's all it does, and then that's exactly what I wanted. Nope. Wrong button. Wait, what's considered the back button? No controllers. There's nothing to tell me what to do. <laughs> and okay, me smart girl. Let's figure it out. Oh, I would so love to go play with dolphins, like in real life. I think that'd be so cool. I have also gotten my Xbox controller back, and I've. I completely forgotten the buttons that I need to do to push this. Or to push, because like I'm trying to grab onto them, but I don't remember which button it is. Not that one. Sound of silence, dolphins. No, go back. Oh, you know I have to, right? Oh, that's so cool. I love that with all the colors. Oh, that's the best part. That's my like favorite thing about this game is being able to to go up and like do a somersault or just a mess with all the fishies. Ooh, what's that? It's a seashell. Shiny seashell. Is it collectible? Does it do anything? Do I get more health or something? I don't. E I don't even know if you can die in this game. I think it's mostly like look around and explore. Which is my type of game if you want to get in and just relax. But for the sake of the video, I'm probably not gonna look around too much. Or I'm not gonna like explore everything, so. Oh, it's our friend! Oh, I forgot. What, the other ones were uh, Sally... Billy Bottom and Jeffrey? Was that the three we had last time? Ooh, what should we name this guy? Um, we shall name him. Um, er, ooh, I can make it a girl. Let's do. Tara. Yeah. Okay, so we got Tara, Billy Bob, Jeffrey, and Sally. Whoops, I hit my mic. I am sorry. Oh, why is the start button called the back button. It's the start button. It's not the end button. It's the start button. I could literally spend hours looking at all the different fishes this game has. I wonder if like these are actual fish like like they're like in real life. I wonder if these are all actual fishes that you could find out in the wild. Ooh, that guy's cool. I like the pink. Bicolor parrotfish. Anglefish. It's Dory! Oh, that's not Dory. The blue guys were Dory. Uh, except they have the black face, so. It's a cousin of Dory! I love that movie. Like, finally, I like Finding Nemo, but Dory was good too. Ooh. Oh my god. When I was living in Colorado, me. Or, like, my family loves aquarium. We don't... Like, we used to have them. 
but with moving and stuff, we, like, we're waiting for, like, kind of, like, a permanent house to get into to get, like, a big aquarium. But it's really funny. We didn't plan on having fishes in Colorado, um, which I lived in Colorado f from when I was three to fifth grade. I, I left in the middle of fifth grade. Um, so a good couple years there. And we went to, uh, I think it was a school fair. And it was, I had to throw a football through a wheel. So I, I was just doing it for fun, you know? Ooh! <gasps> Prairie sharks! I love sharks. Like, I, they would probably be scary as crap in real life, but I love sharks. So cool. Uh, anyways, back to my story, though. Um, I wasn't trying to do it for a prize. I was just seeing if I could get the football through the, through the well. <laughs> and I did it, and the guy was like, Here, Oh, here's a goldfish. And so at first I wasn't gonna take it. I'm like, where am I gonna put a goldfish? You know, I didn't have I didn't have a tank. I didn't have an aquarium. I knew nothing about fish. My dad's like, yeah, go ahead, take it. So I ended up taking it home. And they were like, well, now we need a tank and we need to get food for it. So we went and we bought a couple other fishes and we ended up buying an aquarium. So I actually started. It. Um, we actually got an aquarium because I won a goldfish at school. Which was really cool. I love seeing all the different fish. I don't know like if any of you guys are into it, but uh, my favorite fish that we ever got was ooh puffer fish. That's not my favorite fish. That was just what these guys are. My favorite fish. I don't, I don't know what they're called, but they're like little orange, like narrow type fish. But on the fin, they have the Mickey Mouse uh, silhouette. I think is amazing. It was so cool. It's really funny. Uh, we went... I don't remember why, but we were getting more fish for our aquarium. And I got, like, this Dalmatian-looking fish. It was white with the black spots. It turned out that fish was pregnant when we brought it home. So we ended up having these little tiny fishes swimming around in our aquarium. I think most of them got eaten, which was kind of sad, but I just think that was funny that I brought home this pregnant fish and that pregnant fish. It was really funny. Like, I didn't even know. I just picked it out because I was like, oh, that one looks cool. I like the way its spots are faced. This would be so cool if this was a ride. Ooh, oh, I almost missed the fish. Get him! I don't even know if that does anything. I just... Wah! Follow me, fishes! Are they, like, stuck? Oh, are they trying to go the wrong way? And I'm, like, trying to help them? That'd be cool. Wait, uh, I missed the one on top. Ooh, close to Get it, get it, get it! Yes! Fishies! Oh, they went up! And they're gonna follow me? Ooh, what are those guys? Oh, those guys. Whales! Oh, killer whales. I love whales. Like, I love all animals. I would love to be able to, like, travel and see these guys in their natural habitat. Like, to be on a boat and see them come jumping out of the waves would be amazing. I would really love to be able to see, like, all this stuff to learn how to dive and go see everything. Like, that, like... Like, that'd be my dream, would be able to travel and just go see, like, I want to see everything, you know? I want to see all the different animals that are out there. Oh, we get- YES! This part of the game! Ooh. Well, I went to all of our colors in fun time. Hey, buddy. Oh, we didn't give a name to our diver. We need to name our diver. What shall we name the diver? Hmm, we have yellow and black and you have triangles. Let's name you. Oh, 
I want to name you something kind of silly, but at the same time, not too silly. I still wonder what that is. Is that, is that like a black hole or something? Oh, the last time we did the stingrays, didn't we? Yeah, the stingrays. Ooh, the same with star you. Like the Pokemon? Okay, so we have Billy Bob, Jeffrey, Sally, Terror. Oh, we lost Terror. I didn't even remember. Uh, okay, so Billy Bob we lost, Jeffrey we lost, Sally we lost, and Terror we lost. <laughs> Alright, but but we have Star You with us. <laughs> well, I mean, we are Star You, so of course. I wonder if this place is like a spiritual place, or is it like the control room maybe? Because it seems like. Like, I, we're just going through these areas, and then we come here, and then, like, life pops out. Ooh, the killer whales. I always, like, found it really sad. Like, if you read in the news, like, I forget how long ago it was, but when that killer whale killed that trainer at SeaWorld, I was saying it's kind of sad that they blame the whale for that. Like, you put him in this environment that's not his, you take him from his family, and then you get pissed when he does what he's supposed to do, which is hunt and, you know, and not, like, you know, should take in every precaution. And I, and I do think you can create bonds with wild animals, but at the same time, you have to remember that they're wild animals. I always think it's sad that they- Oh, there's a baby with them! Oh, can I- can I ride one of them? I wanna- I wanna- I wanna grab one! I wanna swim with you! Wrong button, and though that is cool. Oh, there's Terror! Hi! I am calling- I think I'm saying Terror? Okay, I had to look it up. Oh, yes, okay. I don't know. Oh, that's so cool. Like, I could literally spend hours in this game just like floating along and swimming along with one of these guys. Can I, can I hang out with the baby? Baby, come back. No, I don't want you. I mean, you're cool, but I want the big one. Little one. I want the baby. Why are you? Da 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 <laughs> Oh, they all jumped! It's so cool! I love how colorful this game is. Like, all the different colors. Like, the ocean scares me because it, it is kind of like an alien world underneath there. Like, you don't know what you're going to find. And it's so deep and so massive that you could literally find anything out there. At the same time, it's really cool and I would really love to learn how to dive or to get a boat to go out there. Hey, it's our uh, parrotfish. Barracuda! My color pup. Yeah, we did those. We did that one. Like, if this wasn't a video, I would spend hours going individually seeing what all these fishes were. Ooh, that guy was hungry. <gasps> There's a unicorn fish? Is that like his actual nose or. Wait, let's see if we can find them. All oh, of those guys. Oh, they're so cool looking. I love this music too. This music's really good. Turtle! Turtle! What are you? 
Green sea turtle. Oh, I love turtles. They are so cool. Like, there's something, like, really special about turtles, I think. Like, I couldn't explain that. I just feel like turtles are, like, really special. You see, we got another temple. I wonder if... Ooh, shark. Was that the, the scarred one we seen? So did we make him? Because that, that he's coming out of the orb. Did we make that shark? So, and it, and it hasn't attacked us. It's just, like, ran away a lot. So I wonder if it's, if, if, if he's, like, friendly to us. Wow, look at that school of fish. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, that is cool. Oh my god, look at those sharks going through it. Oh, you know I got it. You know I got it. Oh, I even got the gold feet. Ooh, what is that? Look at that drone. See, I wonder if like this used to be all on land. Because we have the temples and the statues, and then we have like this triangle thing. So I wonder if this used to be all on land and now it's underneath the water. Ooh, good job. Eat some more. Oh, <laughs> nice. Oh, what is that? Is that a well? Are those the, the, the humpbacks? I was gonna say graybacks. I don't think that's an actual well. Is that a humpback? Yes! Humpback well. <laughs> oh, can you go to the surface? Can we, can we go, go do the flippy through the, uh, ocean? Surface. Air. Go into the air. Do a wave. Do it, do it. No. You need to make it all the way to the top. Go back up. What are you doing? That's a wall. That's a wall, dude. Don't go that way. Don't, don't go that way. It's just a very calm little well, isn't it? All right. Well, you're not gonna flip through the air. Are you gonna dive bomb the fish? No. Well. Is he? Ooh. Is that a shark on you? Oceanic white tip shark. Oh, that's so cool. I love how many different, like, types of animals there are. Like, just different types of sharks and whales. And wow, that guy had a huge mouth. It's really funny that, like, whales as big as him can survive on such small fish. Like, you think you need something large in order for large fish to survive. Pilot fish. Gray reef shark. I think the white tip are my favorite shark right now. Five line sniper. Snapper. I guess that makes sense. He has five lines going down his side. Oh, see, what is that big door? We went through one earlier, didn't we? Ooh. I. Maha Maha? Is that how you say it? I wonder, like, because we went through one of these doors before, didn't we? I think we did, because isn't that where uh, Billy Bob, Jeffrey, and Sally went? Or is that calling her Sarah? Is this, nah, I'm gonna go Sally. Open Sesame! Bye, Tara! Do we build this? Like, were these were our homes and then it got underneath water? Or did we build it and, like, put it underneath the water for some reason? 
Because they look like giant tunnels. So, did we live underground and we made it to make it easier to go places? Wow, this place is cool. I like the orange color. Why is there a chain on the floor, though? Ooh, was it to a ship? We need to go explore a ship. Oh, that's so pretty. Ooh, what are you? You look like a pancake. I love his face. A sunfish. I like his face. He's so cute. You also look, seriously look like a pancake to me. Is this no, that's just a statue. Look at all the different fish. Ooh, that guy kind of looks like he has a shirt on because he's all black and then he has the red. Oh! Ooh, ooh, um. Um. Bumblebee! We'll name you Bumblebee. So, Sally, Jeffrey, and Billy Bob, and Tara, and now we have Bumble. And then we got Staryu as the diver. Ooh, hammerheads! Oh, so cool. I love the way hammerheads look. They're such a unique looking shark. And that's the Huxville Sea Turtle. I think I like the green guys better. Oh, look how cool these guys look. <laughs> Wait. Let's name you Cheddar. So we got Bumblebee and Cheddar. See, this place totally looks like it was on land. Before it got any water. Ooh! Eagle Ray! Oh, those guys are so cool! See, like, are, are Eagle Rays actually real? Oh, look how cool he looks! I like that he's like a blue color with white dots instead of like the typical gray and black color. I can create or bring to life or teleport into this land. Uh, I'm gonna go with a big and nope for that. Hi, sunfish. Wait, what is that? What are those? from though you weren't up here guys I don't know if you follow me on Instagram but I put up a nature pictures I've taken and one of them was a manatee I took it was a mom and its baby I was so happy that we got to see it there's this uh, 
nature park where I live, like in Florida, there's a lot of nature parks, but this one had a bottom glass boat ride and it's, I want to say, like, it's not out on the ocean. It's in, like, like a river. I think it's called, like, Waktahaka Springs or something like that. And yes, I did butcher that first half. Um, but you normally know see, like, a lot of uh, crocodiles out there. Or alligators. I, for I forget the difference. Something to do with the snout to tell those apart. But and you see a couple stingrays. There's a lot of birds. Whoa, did I just teleport through the wall? Um, where is this? But very rarely do mantis, like they normally go there, but normally not at the time that me and my family go there. And it's one of my favorite places to go. But I was so happy our last trip there, we got to see a mantis, a mom with her baby. That was the best part like like those moments like you don't get a lot of those like I doubt I'll ever see like a wild manatee again but I have to fit her I have to put a picture it's not the best because it was taken with my phone and I'm not quite used to taking pictures with my phone but ooh, secret secret but I'm really glad I was able to capture it, and I'm really glad we got to see them. And it was right as we were we were about to dock the boat, too, and they were just hanging out. And the, the baby actually came up and was bumping against the boat, like, What are you? You want to play? It was so cool. See, there's not, like, there's no other buildings or islands. It's all just water straight through. And a bunch of birds. Well, but we gotta be close to the land, because the birds gotta land eventually, don't they? Although, I think birds can fly for a long time, depending on what type they are. I really want to know if sunfishes are real. Like, can you- are they actually that big in, like, real life? Hi, blue fishes! Ooh! Oh, the orange stingrays! I like stingrays. I like- I like the way they look. They're such a unique creature. Also, I like all, like- You know how, like, there's, like, spiritual animals and- uh, how each animal has like traits to go along with it like a lion is proud and like if you're a snake it means you're kind of like slippery and uh, like clever you know kind of like the Hogwarts house but I like the, the stingrays the meaning that they have attached to them I love that they have the the rust on the chains. I mean, I don't think it would work, but I, I think that's a cool touch that the that they have the rust color to it instead of just having it be like, oh, this works perfectly. It's metal under like that's a nice touch. Open sesame. I'm also curious because we, we've ran into a lot of animals, but we haven't ran into anyone else. And these robots that have been like damaged or buried, we've run into them. But we haven't run into any other divers like we are. No. I can do it later. Fish. Aren't lion 
seen fish poisonous, like the the tips of their uh, needles? I think they are. I think if you touch them, the needles are poisonous on them. I also like how this game goes from like really colorful to oh, it's a shark. Hi, buddy. Are you are you friendly? Or are you gonna, or are you gonna attack us? Are you? See, he runs away. I'm really curious about him. Okay, and this is obviously not a meditation statue. Oh, I bet there's secrets. I bet there's a secret somewhere. Has such good colors. I like how it's like it'll be all dark and then like they have the yellow that pops. I also like if I didn't finish this thought, I like how it'll be all like colorful. Oh, an octopus! I like how it'll be all uh colorful and I'll just go to this like dark and kind of like grim atmosphere. is so cool and then like we'll bring life back to this place so I wonder what our role is in is this are we like the guardian of this place and we have to go through like every couple of days to make sure everything's staying alive I don't know I have so many questions for this game but I absolutely love it I love the color and I love the atmosphere that it has um, but I'm gonna leave this episode here so Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series, and I'm sorry that I don't have a webcam for this. I am working on fixing this, and I seem to have so many problems trying to do the recordings lightly. But, um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you warriors later.